guys and welcome to a new Wix demo session. Today's topic is very interesting. We will show you how you can use Google Online Spreadsheets to fill data that will be displayed in our Wix website. For that, we will be consuming Google APIs to retrieve data from our online spreadsheet and displaying it nicely in our website. You can easily update your spreadsheet and it will instantly reflect on your website. This can save you time instead of having to manually add or update data in your Wix database. First, let's start with our awesome sneakers demo website. As you can see in this web page, we have a list of all shoes on sale that are displayed using a repeater with information such as brand, gender, price, and some pictures. We also have on the left side of the page our filters box to refine your results. For more information on these filters, please refer to our previous Filters Demo session video. For our online store Google Spreadsheet, we have some columns with information like article name, description, brand, sport, gender, color, size, etc. We are also using online Google Spreadsheet list functionality to make it easier for users to input data. Let's have an example. We first fill in the article name and description. Select the brand from the drop-down list, as well as sport, gender, color, and size. For pictures, we already have some stored in our media site file, so we will be using Wix static URLs. We fill in the remaining columns, original and selling price, reseller, and for the archive boolean flag, this can be useful in case we want to store some articles in our database but not display them in our website. Let's say, for instance, if an item is currently out of stock. Once we are done filling in all of the data, the online Google spreadsheet will save automatically and we can now go back to our online store demo site to refresh the page. As you can see, the new article is now added to the list with all information coming from the online spreadsheet. Let's now take an existing article and change the archive flag to true. If we go back to our demo web page and refresh it, you can see that the item is no longer available in the list of shoes on sale. Thank you guys for your time and I hope you enjoy this quick video. Stay tuned for our next demo session and thank you for watching.